In this video, I'm going to give you my favorite 10 soaps from Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements or PAA. Stay tuned. Hey there, folks. And welcome back for another video. I'm your host, CDB. Thanks so much for joining me today. I really appreciate it. And recently, someone on Instagram reached out and wanted me to do a list of my favorite 10 soaps from PAA. And it's really hard to do, but I'm going to give you my list counting down from number 10 all the way down to number one, my favorite. Keep in mind, these are my favorites. It's likely to be different from yours. Whenever I do this, people are always like, that soap should have been number one and so on. This is my list. This is my list. These are the ones I enjoy. And there may be scents on here that you don't, you don't enjoy at all. So please keep in mind, it's a very subjective thing. Let's kick it off with number 10, Future Fiction. And this is a soap that doesn't get a lot of mentions and I'm not sure why because I love it. Uh, some of the notes in here, lemon, uh, bay leaf, musk, pepper. It has some sweetness. It has a little bit of a uh, herbal nature to it as well, maybe from that pepper. Um, I really, really like this. It reminds me a little bit of uh, Sterling Sandpiper, if you've ever smelled that particular scent. This is number 10, PAA Future Fiction. Coming up next, we have Alphine. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, this is a polarizing scent. Some people love it, some people really don't like it at all. It's one of those scents where you just never know if you're going to like it. I really like it. I think Steve Walker, uh, who's on YouTube, really characterized it the best when he says, uh, this smells girly, but in a manly way. <laughs> it's bright. It's nice. I really like it. And it comes in at number nine, El Fiend. Coming up next, uh, this is sort of a seasonal special soap from PAA. This is Rabid Peach, and it is simply a combination of banana and peach. It is very, very, very nice. I like it a lot. It's bright. Uh, it just makes my day. I gotta smell, I gotta smell. Woo! <laughs> I really like it. Really bright, really nice, rabid peach. Coming up next, we have, which one do we have here? Cold Spices. And this smells like uh, Old Spice, but it has some uh, menthol as well. So you get some cooling. Very, very nice if you like Old Spice. This is for me, one of the best versions, this smells similar to the old Shulton Old Spice. And I'm going to use that again soon because I really love it. Coming up next, we have at number six, Clown Fruit. Now, I know a lot of people are like, that should have been number one. But really, for me, Clown Fruit is a scent I really love. But it's not my favorite. It is a very good scent. This is a seasonal. usually comes out around Halloween. Uh, the best way I can describe this is... It smells sort of reminiscent of root beer or the root beer candy that you get, the little root beer barrels. It is a very nice scent and soap that is clown fruit. Coming in at number five, we have Irish Springs. This is a seasonal, which you'll see probably a couple of months from now, maybe in April. And it smells like this. It will remind you very much of the Irish Spring bar soap, which I like a lot. Really, really nice scent. Coming up next, we have, what number are we at? We're at number four, and this is chocolate bourbon. Gourmand lovers, you really can't miss with this. You get a chocolate, you get some of the bourbon, but for me, I think you get more of a dark uh, chocolate. It is beautiful, and I would mention also that the aftershave for this, if you get it, it lasts all day. I put this on sometimes in the morning, and the next day, I still, <laughs> I still smell it. It is a beautiful gourmand type scent, chocolate bourbon. Coming in at number three, one of the classics from PAA is I See It Cad. This is a barbershop scent that smells uh, similar to uh, Barbersaw, the shaving cream. Beautiful, beautiful scent. One of the best barbershop scents, in my opinion, or at least ones that I like the most, Cad by PAA. Coming in at number two, Awesome Sauce. I love this. I ask um, PAA to make this. They did, and it smells like Perazzo Green aftershave, not the soap. Please, if you if you love the, the Perazzo Green after, uh, soap, but not the aftershave, this one, keep in mind, smells like the aftershave, not the soap, which is different. Beautiful green scent. You get some eucalyptus, but overall it has a green scent and it has menthol, so the, there's some nice cooling in it. I absolutely love this. They nailed it. It smells nearly identical to Perazzo Green. And my number one scent from PAA, and it has been this way for many, many years. It's one he made fairly early on, The Beach. This reminds me very much of Copper Tone um, from the 70s, uh, Hawaiian Tropics, something like that. When you smell it, 
it absolutely reminds you of that suntan lotion at the beach. And this is, this is another one where if you get the aftershave splash, it lasts a long, long time. My absolute favorite scent of all time for PAA, the beach. All right, folks, there you have it. Those are my 10. If you have uh, 10 soaps that you really love from PAA, I'd love to see your list below. I want to thank you so much for watching as always. Remember, I'm your host, CDB, reminding you, your shave, do it your way, and as always, God bless.